My name is Maylin Scott. Welcome to The Cell. I will be your guide as we review one of the responses associated with diseases such as diabetes, cancer, and asthma. Join me in learning about the unfolded protein response, aka UPA. First, we need to understand proteins and their folding. Let's look at a ribosome. Proteins are built here in ribosomes and play critical roles in the structure and function of the cell. Proteins are made up of amino acids, which form a long chain and then fold and coil themselves into a 3D shape through bonds. Any aspect, such as the salt concentration or temperature, can cause the protein to unravel, losing its shape and be unfolded. So what happens next? The proteins move to the endoplasmic reticulum, ER for short. Think of the ER like a shipping company. It packages the proteins and distributes them for other cell uses, but also serves as a factory to monitor these proteins and make sure they are properly folded. If they're badly folded, they get destroyed, aka ER-associated degradation. But what happens when the ER fails to destroy the protein? They pile up and the ER can get overwhelmed. In response to the stress, the ER initiates a series of coping mechanisms, the unfolded protein response. There are three main protein sensors, like the managers, that detect the stress and are held in check by a chaperone protein, or a supervisor, with the goal of bringing the system back into balance. These reactions include expanding the ER to allow for more space to process these proteins, telling chaperone proteins to fold more proteins, reducing the synthesis of new proteins, and increasing the protein degradation process. Plus, during these stressful times, other organelles are notified and protected from being damaged. And if all else fails, the cell destroys itself. So how can UPR lead to treatments and cures? In diabetes, insulin cells die from protein folding glitches. In cancer cells, the UPR is wired to help grow more cancer cells. And UPR has been implicated in asthma symptoms. By creating drugs to alter the UPR, we may just find treatments and cures for many diseases.